All right, we're going to go over how to assemble an M60 feed tray. Um, we'll first quickly go over the components. We have the feed tray itself. There's the part number on there. Most of these are stamped with that, 7792087. Uh, and the components to assemble this are the belt pawl spring, the belt pawl itself, the roller shaft, and we have two rollers. All right, this is gonna be a very quick video, um, and it's very simple to do this. However, some people have difficulty with it, so we wanted to make a video on it. All right, first thing first, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our feed tray and we're gonna flip it over, and if you look underneath here, you can see there's an opening right here, and that's where your belt pole is gonna sit. So you wanna take your belt pole with this curved pole edge facing down and set it in that slot there. Let me zoom in a little bit. And uh, then we wanna take our spring, and there's two ends of spring. You have that long shaft and then that short curved piece. We're gonna take that and we're gonna put it right there. And we have to push these in simultaneously. I'm gonna use a tool to do it. So we push both these in at once and you can see that snaps in place there. Okay, and then our belt pole is sticking up. That's what holds our, holds our belt on. All right, now this is an important part. This can be a huge pain. You wanna take your roller and put it in this bottom uh, slot. You can see there's a hole going through there. Again, we're gonna use a tool as a guide. All right, so once we put that through, we're gonna take another roller and put it in there on the second slot, we have a hole up top. Take our shaft, back this out so you can see. And what we have to do is we have to tap this through. And you gotta hold these, hold these rollers in place when you're doing it, because if they move a little bit, they get stuck in this groove and it's a real pain to get them in and out. So we're gonna hold these right in place. All right, we can see it start to go here. And again, this is important here to hold this in place. So this uh, groove clears the roller. So let's keep tapping. And we can see our, our guide is pushing out bottom. All right, and that's seated, it's flush. And we have our feed tray assembled, okay? Now look, there's two different ways to do this. We use rollers for uh, this one, but this has like an ammo hanger on it. The ammo hanger on these attaches where the rollers go in. So again, if you want to put an ammo hanger on, and let me grab one for reference. We can see this ammo hanger, see the holes for the shaft. Uh, you basically put your uh, belt pole and your spring in, and then you put this piece lined up in your feed tray and same thing just tap your uh, roller shaft through that's it that is how to assemble an m60 feed tray